The Anaplolepis gracilopes, commonly known as the yellow crazy ant, is one of the most destructive invasive species worldwide. It is in the order Hymenoptera and the family Formicidae, and is characterized by its exceptionally long antennae, long legs, and erratic movement, hence the crazy in its common name. They are typically 4 millimeters in length, have long heads, and are usually golden brown in color with subtly striped abdomens. They do not have stingers, rather workers are able to spray formic acid from their acidopores, a special opening in their abdomen. This is used in subduing both attackers and prey. Their formic acid is so strong, in fact, they are dangerous in large numbers to particularly large organisms, such as chickens, rats, and even humans. The yellow crazy ant is thought to have originated in Southeast Asia, or in parts of Africa, but they have spread to Africa, Asia, North America, and the Oceania regions through international trade. Their life cycle is typically 76 to 84 days, with eggs hatching around 19 days after being produced and pupae developing in around 20 days. Queens, on the other hand, can live for multiple years and can lay 700 eggs per year during their reproductive lifespan. The yellow crazy ant is particularly formidable due to their tendency to live and use social super colonies, which is like if several smaller ant colonies merge together to create one huge living organization. These super colonies house multiple queen ants and have been seen to be as large as 20 million ants per hectare. The ants are able to form colonies almost anywhere, such as in shrubbery, leaf litter, and man-made buildings. Yellow crazy ant colonies are also characterized by being unusually unaggressive towards ants of different colonies, to the point where workers of different colonies will help each other out, transferring resources and, on occasion, even helping populate empty nests of new yellow crazy ant queens. The notoriety of the yellow crazy ant understandably lies in the fact that they are an incredibly invasive species. They have been found in large numbers worldwide, generally thriving in almost any condition and climate. They are spread locally through the transfer of plant material and internationally by sneaking onto cargo ships used in forms of trade. One notable example of the yellow crazy ant invasion is on the Christmas Islands in Australia, where they started to have a significant negative impact in the late 1990s on the red crab, which is especially dangerous to the ecosystem as the red crab is a keystone species. The ants are facilitated by a mutualistic relationship with another invasive species, the yellow lac scale insect. They rely on each other as the ants protect the scale insects, which in turn provide the ants with honeydew or a sweet excrement they produce. The red crabs on Christmas islands are known for having long group migrations, where they are attacked by the ants which spray formic acid into their eyes and joints. The ants have also taken over the crabs' burrows and nesting sites. The best form of ant control was found to be the implementation of a species commonly known as the microwasp, a parasitoid of the scale insects as an indirect biocontrol agent. Each wasp can parasitize 150 scale insects and originate from a very similar climate to that of the Christmas Islands. The Christmas Island yellow crazy ant predicament is a testament to the potential strength of biocontrol, especially when dealing with a notoriously resilient pest. With more research on the introduction of biocontrol agents to parts of the world invaded by yellow crazy ants, it is possible that previously unbalanced ecosystems could begin to be safely restored.